Hi, my name is Hannah Steven, and I'm a grade 12 student at St. John High School. I'm pitching to the host of a better established true crime podcast. When I was 15, my best friend was texting this guy that we had never heard of before, and I was a little skeptical. I told her that he probably wasn't who he said he was because information about him online was very minimal, and I didn't have a good feeling. She brushed it off and continued. About a year later, my mom sent me a CBC article that talked about this man, this pedophile, that made fake accounts to lure underage girls in and to get them to send him nude photographs. One of his aliases was this teenage boy my friend had been texting a year earlier. I saw the article once and then heard nothing about it again. News channels in, in the Maritimes normally only cover something once, unless it's something major. They then forget about it afterwards, moving on to the big city problems. With podcasts, that information is saved on the internet for as long as you need it. The majority of the population doesn't know the impact that true crime podcasts have, especially for women, and how important it is for us to have that information. According to Department of Justice Canada, between 1980 and 2014, there were almost 7,000 police-reported female homicide cases in Canada. And according to Vickery, women have claimed that consuming true crime content led to a conscious change in behavior to ensure safety. Another thing the true crime world lacks is a fresh perspective or a younger voice. I listen to true crime for almost three hours a day, every day, and I follow five concrete trusted podcasts that I've listened to since 2020. On my first episode alone, I spent over 50 hours recording editing and marketing for the release of Behind Closed Doors. My podcast, Behind Closed Doors, is a podcast dedicated to spreading awareness and sharing paranormal and true crime stories to residents in St. John. There are not many local podcasts that just focus on Canadian true crime or paranormal stories, and Behind Closed Doors will provide short, accurate episodes on these that are entertaining to listen to from a fresh, young perspective. My overall goal is to release seven episodes or one season by January 21st and to have 300 listens on my Spotify account. Please listen to episode one, and if you enjoy it, possibly collaborate on future episodes. My audience consists of younger listeners, and it would bring a brand new following to your podcast. Thank you for your time.